pumpkin. Really big pumpkin. The City of Birmingham Symphony Orchestra, it's not just a world-class symphony orchestra. We're also an organisation that's seeking to have a real impact on our local schools and young people across the West Midlands. The CBSA Musical Leadership Project is a three-year programme in which we're working with a secondary school, a special needs school and feeder primary schools. This project involves sending out CBSA musicians, a composer and a creative writer to go in and work with over 350 children within those schools. Well, as a writer, it's, it's fun working with young people. It makes me feel really alive to get all those ideas and to meld them together. I mean, I think there's such a wonderful overlap between words and rhythm and music. It's really crucial for every young person to have the opportunity to experience music. And I think for an organisation like the CBSO, where every day there's these amazing musicians meeting together, rehearsing and performing, for those same musicians to come into schools, for these young people to experience working uh, alongside and with these musicians, just presents both a, an inspirational activity and also an aspirational activity. Inspired them in a way which I think working within the confines of a classroom and the traditional curriculum you struggle to do. It definitely did add something other than what we would normally expect to see. Uh, I saw students who really perhaps, they never thought they would actually perform in front of others. Students whose re real creative side had come out and collectively it was absolutely inspirational. The children love the sessions that they attend. Um, they love being able to have exposure to different types of musical instruments where in school we as a staff haven't always got the ability to play the instruments that the children come into contact with. I like that the CBSO always bring, let us bring instruments and we can play our instruments however we like, we can make music with them. I'm not sure when they'd get any other opportunity such as this to have players such as ourselves in such close quarters and have that ability then to discuss what they've heard. The best part is the emotion that I have joining in together and singing. I'm feeling really happy because of the music, my heart, my heart's smiling at what I'm singing. We're working out which instrument we should have, like maybe drums or like pianos and like cello and violins. It was really fun to do that. We were all playing the instruments together and it sounded beautiful. They are definitely more creative than they used to be. They've been given the opportunity to be able to write songs where they've never really had that before. And the relationship between the children and the staff is just phenomenal now. A crucial part of this project is continual professional development for the teachers who have been involved together with our music students from the Conservatoire and University. Through this project it's given me an extra confidence and uh, more experience of leading workshops and doing creative things with children. We started to really connect and, and I would ask them questions and I felt it, it was a lot more personal. School is one of the places where creativity is really important to mould into children and give them the opportunity to develop who they are as a person, who they are musically. And this project's really helped them have a firm foundation of being able to explore that for themselves. Today we're performing at, at this church as at a singing festival. It's really important that as part of this project the children have the chance to share their creative achievements with the other schools who have been involved and our community concerts give the pupils the chance to do just this, not only to perform to their peers but also to perform to their family and friends. My name's David Lawrence and I'm conducting the workshops today. The relationship between their director and them is key to any kind of success. So I've been trying to find ways of doing that through warm-up games that we've had and, and try and have them trust me. So they've been able to watch the other choirs uh, do their workshop rehearsal and hopefully they've managed to learn not just repertoire but other presentation ideas and uh, other thoughts through watching the other groups. It's made me feel better as before I thought I was like not a very good singer but now I feel like more confident. 
think it's uh, really good because we've never done this before in our school and um, most of the other schools never get much of this experience. We all got to get together and sing and it's pretty fun. Well, I thought it was super, and I'm the trustee from the CBSO who looks after education, and when you see a finished product, it makes it all worthwhile. They sang beautifully. I just thought they were brilliant, very well rehearsed. The music was great. I, I love the fact that they'd actually written some of the songs themselves and had input into the performance as well, so it was fantastic. Well, it gives them something more than, than what they do at school, anything normal. This, this, this is really brought them out of themselves, so very impressed. The partnership with the CBSO is really special. We're very fortunate in Birmingham to have a world-class symphony hall and the world-class CBSO itself. For our young people, attending a concert at symphony hall is not something most of them would normally do. So to actually go and see the venue and to experience, you know, the power of listening to an orchestra in that venue will be absolutely inspirational. Sometimes an orchestra can be quite a hard sell to, to young people, so to bring them to an event like this, to see members of an orchestra in action, close hand, hopefully it has a knock-on effect at school, so that's what we're hoping for. I think it's been a really good experience and not many other people, not many other schools have it, so I think it was really good for us. It's been a real joy to work with all of our schools and also with students from Birmingham Conservatoire and Birmingham University. And we feel that this project has had a tremendous impact on our local schools and we're really looking forward to developing our relationships with them throughout the next couple of years. CBSO have been absolutely fantastic. They've actually been able to come in and work at our young people's level and move them on in their learning. The project has inspired many of them to take up an instrument, to start composing and perhaps to think of themselves as a composer. I think that my relationship with the children has changed now. Um, as a music teacher before, the children would come into the music sessions and just be a little bit reserved. But now, automatically, they're just more open and more confident in their approach. To see the impact that music does have on these children, it's just it's really great to be a part of. I mean, the amount of skills that the kids will learn from that, not just musical things, but problem solving, working as a group, listening to people. I mean, it's just valuable things in life, let alone music. We've made a connection with them. We've made a connection with them personally and musically. And I think, I think something really concrete has come out of it. don't actually get to work with professionals every day, but you know, it's really cool. Hopefully we've given them some inspiration musically and creatively and, and who knows where it will lead with them in the future. Absolutely amazing. It's amazing. It was just fantastic, a first sight, really enjoyable. Really a proud, you know, proud mum. It's lovely to see those children enjoying themselves. And let's face it, City of Birmingham Symphony Orchestra. What else could you? Oh, wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Amazing. Really inspiring. It's so fun to think and after this could you come again and do more work with us because I don't because we really enjoyed it.